Draw with me the stomach. The stomach is an empty pouch located between the esophagus and the duodenum. It plays an important role in digestion both through mechanical and chemical actions and is part of the digestive system. It occupies a large part of the supramesocolic compartment of the abdomen beneath the left diaphragmatic dome. Its capacity ranges from 1.2 to 1.5 liters and it transforms the food bolus into chyme through the action of gastric juice and the churning created by its own musculature. Its wool is composed of three layers, a serous layer, part of the peritoneum, a muscular layer, and a mucosal layer. It has two orifices, an entry orifice, the cardia, and an exit orifice, the pylorus. The pylorus is a region where the musculature is more developed, allowing it to function like a sphincter between the stomach and the duodenum. The stomach is divided into three parts, the upper portion, called the fundus, the central portion, called the body, and the lower portion, called the entrum. It also has two curvatures, the great curvature, which is its left border, and the lesser curvature, which is its right border. Its arterial blood supply comes exclusively from the celiac trunk and its branches forming two circles around the lesser and greater curvatures. The venous drainage follows a similar path to the arterial supply, draining into the portal vein.